Hello again and welcome back to my channel. I am Victoria. This is Victoria Vulture. Voop, voop. In case you didn't know what a weird noise was, there's the wings, right? The kobo or the vulture wings flapping. I hope you got it. Anyway, um, join me today now. A lonely Brianna going to work. And I with my foolish self trying to save and plan. I don't know why it doesn't shut up. I tell Ole she's the brain, I the pinky. I go on and tell the plumber he could come today to see about the toilets to fix them first because in the previous video you'll see that the toilets give him trouble, right? Now I want her to use bedpan and posy. I wouldn't mind, you know, if you ain't had to get up to walk all the way to the toilet, I wouldn't mind you know, using the little posy. Is the emptying it and washing it after. <clears throat> right? So the plumber come in today and I'll be all alone and... Uh, we're a single woman as I say and we don't have no man in the house at any time unless it's something like this you have to fix something so stay with me today now and keep my company on top of that a little sad because today is kind of the official last day of my holiday if you could say so because school officially opening for teachers tomorrow and Friday we'll be out well virtually out I'm having whatever meetings and you know so my holiday kind of gone with plumber so, see what mischief I could get into and what I could do to enjoy my holiday still. Huh? Thanks. I need you. And if you haven't yet, please press the little subscription bell so you'll know every time I post. And like, comment, and subscribe. I'm hustling to go and wash the ways there. I mean, you shouldn't be looking any, at anything in the kitchen. It's the toilets, right? But pride in my tail now. There's some little ways from where I sneak and eat some things during the night. Yeah, I do get for water, I get for snacks and sandwich and... I don't know where my weight does go on and watch. Watch my neck now. <laughs> Look at these two little bad boys I got um, growing up on the North Coast here. Uh, well, in the last video now. They sweeter. I don't know if it's called them sugar apple or um, mommy apple. No. Yeah, sugar apple, mommy apple or cashew However, these bad boys go in my belly. Well, at least one this morning for breakfast. What is that? If I start to wash your ears yet? No, I know you know I have ADHD. I like pretty things. So I come outside to see if I can get some flowers to decorate my kitchen and whatever, whatever. So before I could start to wash your ears, I want to decorate the kitchen. I go wash it. I know he come in for nine, but I go wash it. See, I get my flowers. I get my flowers and my plants. So I'm going to decorate the kitchen. I decorate in the kitchen for me so I could get into the mood to clean. I'm not decorating for no plumber. Well, let's stop it. You can wash my ways. A shame. But all you see, as normally I have flowers in the kitchen, but I was busy now. They're still trying to bloom. So I just go and put back some water and some nice fresh flowers. Well, you had too much vice in your head, right? I'm pretty up my. Ooh. I forget. I do like cold, cold fruits, but I just put in this to chill while I wash the bed. I'm going to wash the... I know time flying. All right, I'm going. Let me put it to chill. <laughs> you know what I'm smiling too? <laughs> Remember, um, a while ago, do I smell long? I bought two bowls of soup for me, two bowls of beef soup. And now remember, there is one in the fridge. And now remember, I have soup in the fridge. Well, since, yes, I start to wash the ears. <laughs> Yay. But um, if you notice the flowers full, I wasn't satisfied, so I went back outside for some to pull it up. But anyway, as well, you keep in my company as I wash in ways. Don't go on the creamy as I wash in ways. I'll tell all about the story where I actually nearly turned into a reason. <laughs> When you say is that reason, yes. Anything to do with water. Well, back in the days, um, even though I'm from tongue side, up tongue side, as you could kind of say, Santa Cruz, I went to Corinth Teachers College. That is down south. I'm feeling like a cat here on my lips. What is cat, sir? Yeah, I went to Corinth Teachers College. That is down south, Trinidad, right? And mischievous me, you know why stuff, of course, you know why stuff. Every morning before I go to college, I used to go down Granville Beach, that is deeper south. 
and take a nice early morning dip. Now I leave in home all kind of five o'clock so I can reach TV shop at five. I have all my school stuff, everything packed, my clothes, what not. I had rats in them days. You rats so far right here, style. Locks. Yeah, long locks in them days. So it wasn't nothing to just shake out my natty when I finished bath. So anyway, this one beautiful day I pack up myself and I went to the beach and strip. I used to bathe naked because it's early in the morning I clothes to be thinking to stay sour in my car whole day. I used to drive them days too. What time for that shipping it? So I bathe naked and I got away with it for months. When I tell you in peace, my early morning bath, I dry up myself. So I didn't really have no sort of streets and I find I love those pictures boy and they like just feel refreshed, like a little oil seeps and little whatever minerals in the water. You feel good. Right? This morning, however, I have a time bathing. If you see a girl, when I do so and look down the beaches because I hear it and seeing dogs, three dogs barking, big dogs eh, coming along the beach, when they're barking at me, eh, but having a time playing. When I squint and I really fix my eye, it's because there's a man with them coming with these three dogs. And by that time, the sun now starting to peek through the sky. It's time that I supposed to be coming out of the water now to get ready for school. When I see that now, I get terrified. I ain't coming out. There's naked, I tell you, I'm naked. Thank God my stuff wasn't on the beach itself. I had a towel hanging up a little ways away in a tree. But I'm naked in this water and this strange man coming with dogs. I now stoop down. If you see I stoop down in the water, quiet, quiet, hoping that he thinks, you know, if I move my head and thing, you think it's a bobbin coconut or some kind of thing, so I ain't go see me. On the other side now, I pray and the dogs didn't smell me and start to bark and make out my scene hiding naked in the water there. Now, Granville is a long stretch of beach, eh? and I wasn't going to risk. I, I mean, I doubt he does see anything, the speed that I run from the water to the car with it, eh? to the towel first, then the car. I doubt he does see the speed. It's the dogs I was studying. That if I pelt out this, and you can't really pelt out water, and when you're running in, in the beach, it's slow motion, you can barely move your leg and move in. So I can't really pelt out. So I said, if I try my best and running, the dogs will see me and make mouth. If they start to bark, that one thing, but if they start to bark and run behind my little thin foot, and you know, dog like, dog like bone, right? And my leg bone, you know, skin, I say it's trouble. So I stayed in the water and just prayed that nobody looked to the, when it was boy, he come in so, to the right of them. Because they were like, hmm, I tell you, I pray. He took his time because I mean, to the man walking on the beach with his dog, he ain't no idea. He took his time to pass. So that was the longest, I didn't know how long it was, it felt like five years of my life went down the water. Right, that was the longest. I stayed just in one spot alive, not my head, I remember trying to bob to look like a coconut. But that was the longest I think time stood still for, for me in my life, yeah? Waiting for this man and his dogs to pass. Eventually, when they reached directly in front of me, I couldn't breathe. I didn't breathe. I didn't dare breathe. I saw him on them here, nothing, smell nothing. I ain't brushed my mouth yet. The dog said I smell morning breath. <laughs> but anyway, I stayed there until the man, like, walked down to the end where, you know, where he couldn't really hear and the dog was preoccupied. And I never tell, hey, I tell him, I take off as fast as I could out the water, you know, so much of it. I take off and ran to my towel, grab my towel now, breathing heavy like if I, you know, I have testimony morning in church. Hey, you remember them days testimony morning? You have a testimony to give today, sister so and so, I remember them days. Those fathers and God are gone. Hey, or else I know, but anyway, yeah, sad to say, sad to say that was the last time I skinned it. Because I realize now, boy, time's changing. Things could have be different. You know? Things could already be different. And he could have seen and it could have be a, a, a you know a different kind of thinking man and sicky dogs on me and only drama and yeah you would not even see me this morning washing ways and procrastinating. But look, they keep my company 
And I am finished washing the waist. Thank you. I'm going to pass a little broom in the bathroom there where he have to go. And just peek around, make sure them cats and do no mischief. And yeah. Yeah. the plumber is here, right? So half my back. I happen to come outside the same time he reach and Brianna called same time he reach. So but I'm a back right. I look in mommy and shoot my glasses, teacherish. Well he done teeth in my head already asking me if the pump turn off, if the main turn off, if the dis turn off. I don't know nothing about that. And Brianna know nothing about that. We know but we renting. Why know about where the main is and I don't even know where half my own personal belongings is. Pray for me today. I only calling Brianna and we can annoy her. Huh? Just in case he asked me something, I don't know, she might know. But the same thing I know, she know. So I'm not calling her this turbo again, don't mind her like hearing her voice. But I disturb in hand, she dealing with customers. I run outside for two seconds, as you could see. Because all they pray for me now. I single so long, I can't even stand the smell of man. And my house starting to smell like man. I mean, I have male cats, so it smells like man cat. But the smell of man itself, I I got the red light, that, that. <laughs> you know, the house smell like kills me, Brianna, you know. I know it smell like man, so it take me a while to light a few incense and fix up, but I can't eat my, um, my fruit yet because I don't want to be eating and answering questions right through, right through, right through, right through. Yeah, it's on. Yeah, it's still on there. The pressure tank? It have water? So that mean it good? Oh shit. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I'm trying to run to somewhere quiet to talk. Well, you see why it could have a pickup. I can't use the toilets right now. So what do you think I use? <laughs> oh god, my egg boiling. Good thing I come to one away. So down inside you need to study in my belly. I'm going to make some egg salad. My black ass running up and down. Now I have to go and try to find the pump to put on again. It's on! Well, I feel like a plumber in a tire. He had to go. To get a pressure something for the pump. So, in that little time he go on, I might try and eat my um fruit. Look at the time is after 11. I ain't eating nothing yet. My mouth dry. Look, every time I go to do something, it's because I have to answer a question or help or bring a bag. Or, I guess that's great today. Eh? But oh gosh, this is supposed to be my official last day of my holiday. You know, in my bedroom, here in the backyard, the plumber. He called him outside to see something. He say he going there to get some pressure pump for the tank. But I go and see if I could warm my soup tank would have something. So you know it have no tank outside, don't mind me dancing. You don't have no tank outside, right? So it have no flushing or water in the house at the moment. That is why I tell you, get a pickup. It's not only for the car. It's for general use, because I'm going and draw from my cup now. Oh, they look he going there to make this little trip to the hardware. Well, I thought he was going, he coming back again. Well, he's still spinning by ground, look to warm my soup fast. I don't want to snarf it down my mouth next to the hardware right there. But I have to eat something, man. Oh, God, it's after 12. Ah, uh? all right, all right, okay. How much time I tell Ole he was going? Let me do one take out no soup yet, eh? Cause I go and take out the soup, leave it on the counter, peep it out the window, and the cat go get it. And I go end up eating cat today, today, sweet and sour cat with jasmine rice. Ah, the car is reversing. I can't warm up my soup there. My animal is supposed to be doing it my foot. The plumber reached back. About, it's half well, it's nearly after two. And my daughter coming in from my chest now. And he ain't even reaching the gate yet. Blah, 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 blah. So I have to leave what I'm doing to go to listen. 
Why do you, you can't just work quietly and alone? Eh? You had to talk to somebody. I have my things to do. I need to relax here the day before my holiday. And yeah, I deserve to try a tantrum now because I get to do nothing. I couldn't sleep, I couldn't rest because I'm only waiting for the gate to open when to come back to be able to think. I can't eat and let the food settle if I'm waiting for somebody. Anyway, let me go and see what he want now. Well, you see, he installing the new pump system. He nearly catch me there. Tired man, I'm tired, I'm tired. I'm hungry. What a last day of holiday. Wow. It's a good thing I live every day like it's a holiday. Go on the pump. Yeah. All right. Let me hope this is the last pony pump. Eh? Let me hope this is the last pony pump. It on. Why is that Taurus? I want short temper. I think I'm ready to blow. Somebody else's job shouldn't interfere with my flicking whole life. Is that fair? Huh? All right. All right. Oh, everything in fashion. Well, he said everything was okay. And then he just went inside to check to see if everything was all right and looking. Mind you, I didn't know anybody was coming back inside, so I spread out my mother next swan two things again, panty all over, bra all over. I mean, expecting nobody to come back inside when you see you're done and you're outside in the pump, but whatever. You know, and lo and behold, you know, everything working okay until you reach my toilet, which still needs something to change. So it's, as I said, it's after two. My daughter coming home, her work is over at four. This was supposed to be the last of my holiday for me to sleep late, relax, you know, eat what I want, treat myself, you know, and none of it happened. On top of that, I had to hide outside because every fribbing minute, I did it, I did it, I did it, still. Why you check my out, man? I try to show myself on the chair. Watch me. I'm tired. I'm tired. He ain't gone yet. But... I think he say gun something some in some part tired. I think he say gun something some in some line and when I miss him, he gone. So yeah, tired. But I ate my soup. Look creamy. You're so fast. Want to know what I'm doing? Eh? All right. Take care. I don't know. Still making excuse to find things to fix and to wash hand and all kind of thing. Are you telling you? He gone, he gone, he gone. I don't want to say it too hard next time he forget something. But he gone. Mm-mm-mm-mm. Mm-mm-mm. Down. A boogie down, down. Let's groove tonight. I didn't enjoy my little hour holiday, man. Oh, God. There's a spice of life. But look at this man, how me sweating the name, my man. I feel like a plum holy. Well, I'm glad to, I'm glad. I'm glad everything finished. Fingers crossed. I'm glad everything finished and I'm glad everything, you know, working and working well and now. Brianna Massey is so fed up. She's so sweet. So fed up on me having my bam see all over her toilet seat. And when she wake up to tutu, I inside there already. That's the worst thing eh? when you have it hot and you have a personal toilet and you run to go in it and somebody else in it. Look how I run in sweat. Well, then I'm just dry up myself. I'm so happy. Eh? First things first. On my list of things to do quickly before my last year of holiday is done. I seen a bird long time in that shell, a shed, the tool shed in the back. Cute little bird, I feel you have a nest in it, I'm going to unmark it. Couldn't wait to take a stroll, oh my goodness. Ladies, oh look at this pretty butterfly, you see? You see? I don't know if you see. But what is... Butterflies! 
You see why I couldn't wait to come? Oh God, I should put my chair here. I'll just stoop down here for a while and talk. Isn't it pretty? This move with vine behind. And it attracts the prettiest butterflies. Yeah. But anyway, you see why I couldn't wait for the man to leave? You see? You see? Ooh. Oh. Yeah. But what is worse than having to go out and wear a bra? They are coming by my warring plum tree. <laughs> them bees and them must be looking for flowers. Them not on me right now. But what is worse than having to wear a bra when you go out, ladies? Yeah. Wearing a bra home for the entire day because you have a male person inside your premises doing work. And I had to squeeze up my poor tatty butts. My poor little tatty butts in bra whole day at home. You think it fair? If you hear them and I free them. Freedom! But yeah, I'm so happy to be outside. I'm just so happy for the sun. I don't need your greasy and sweaty. I like nothing. <laughs> happy it comes with joy. <laughs> Taking the bun. All right, I'm taking the vitamin D. This one. You're so rude, I was just dancing. Ah, I have about a half an hour to 45 minutes again to relax. Alone for my last day of my holidays before official opening of school tomorrow. So I'd say, you know, let me enjoy my fruit before I leave. You know, I'll show you all how it looks inside. As I say, I ain't too sure of the name if it's Mommy Apple, Sugar Apple, Cashew Man. I'm not sure. I'll get back to you with that. I just want to eat it right now. I love it. Um, I'm not feeling guilty because Bibi do eat this. But let me show you. I can eat it alone. <laughs> everything as we share. Almost every single thing as we share. But um, I'll show you how it look. This is it here close. You see it? I'm going to burst it open. And you'll see. And this is it. It burst open. Look at it. Oh God, I can't wait. I can't wait. And I get to eat it. You see how many of the seeds? And you suck the little pulp off the seed. Look at this little beggar, watch him, watch him, thinking it's something good. But anyway, you see it? Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. Tastes like if you bite off a piece of heaven wall. Tastes like how heaven wall will taste. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like Hansel and Gretel, how the witch trap them with eating the yam. House made of candies. I show the wall. At least in my heaven. Coated with this. <laughs> so y'all thanks for being with me. I am Victoria. Thanks for having my back. Let me finish say thank you. Thanks for having my back today when the plumber was here and I had nobody else. Thanks for putting up with my tantrums and my little quarrels. I'm, I'm moody sometimes, you know, good bipolar. Thanks for... I now see the bird fly by the shed, you know, I never went to see if it had the nest. I did have something for me to do tomorrow. <laughs> anyway, I'm Victoria. This is my channel, Victoria Vulture. Voop, voop. The devil and your wife fighting. Hot sun, but it's starting As Brianna, as a come eh? Poor thing. Um, please like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching. And press the notification bell. Just so they're slipping out my finger. <laughs> Press the notification bell. 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 See you every time I post. Take care. Mm.